Hello YouTube World Marketer Assassin here. If you're new to the channel, uh, subscribe, hit that bell button. Um, I'm an online marketer, affiliate marketer, um, YouTuber, and uh, apprentice psychologist. I'm still st I'm, I study the mind. You know, I, I try my best to study the mind. So I'm gonna, I'm a little of a, I'm a, um, a bit of a apprentice um, psychologist. But one day, I hope to be a master psychologist and fully understand how the mind works. But uh. And I also want to be a master um, online marketer. I think I'm very and fairly good at marketing. Uh, I'm trying to constantly improve my marketing skills every day. And I hope you guys are trying to improve your marketing skills every day. You know, trying to build a brand awareness, trying to big, big, build a bigger brand awareness and all that you do. So, and, you know, uh, find success, do whatever you're trying to do. So, um, yeah, we're going to, um, what we're going to be talking about today is uh, extensions, you know, um, Firefox apps and how if you're a Firefox user this is mainly towards you um, I'm a Google I'm more of a, a Google and a e Microsoft user so, you know those web browsers I'm more of those kind of type of users so uh, if you're a Firefox user this will um, be valuable to you this will um, help you out so um, if you're um, you know when you want to go you want to go to a Firefox apps and uh, you just type in Firefox. I'll put a link down below where you can um, get extensions, you know, because that's what we're going to be talking about. Extensions can basically help you with uh, um, um, the way you control your um, your um, browser. You know, that you can apply, you put it up here, you can apply it over on these in this space right here. Up here, you can apply that to your browser and you can do many things, you know, to your um, browser, including your appearance, your. Um, it's a whole bunch of things up here you can add these are all the extensions right here they even got themes on here and uh, different things of that sort so uh, these are all the extensions but we're not going to be going over all of them we're going to be going over the most important ones especially if you're an online marketer you know this is mainly towards you guys you know and uh, and if you if you're like a it's not just not like if you're I'm a YouTube youtuber um, if you're a video editor, if you're a, even a gamer, if you're even a gamer, or if you're um, uh, what else? You can be a, a blogger, a writer, you know, a typer, a blogger, a website maker, a web developer. You know, these are these are um, uh, you know, these are all pertaining to um you guys. So um, the first thing we're gonna be doing is uh. We're gonna be talking about news, blogging, and all that sort. That's what this is the first one we're gonna click. So you got your social fixer, and um, I haven't really uh, read much about this one. So you know, like I said, I'm learning just uh, I'm learning Firefox just like you guys are learning um, filters. Let me see what I never heard of this one. Let me see that. Uh, Edit filter. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so, um, if you guys got any of that, you know, you can pause the video. If you guys got any of that, um, awesome. Because I didn't, I didn't get any of that. So I didn't get none of that. So uh, we're gonna go back. What else is there? Um, and they even got ridded on here. Emoji, copy and paste, ridded, masks, tagger. So I guess Firefox mostly, you know, works mostly with ridded. They can they, they they do work mostly with Reddit. So uh, what else? Uh, that's just the other ones though. Um, we're gonna do games and entertainment. So if you're these are they got a lot of YouTube things on here, and I've already applied the enhancer for YouTube. I applied that to my browser, and YouTube already even on uh, Chrome. I mean not on Chrome, but uh, on Firefox. Even YouTube on uh, Firefox has their own editor's version, just like Chrome does or anything, because it's still YouTube. But uh, you can also it gives you different features. We can change the theme. You can fast forward videos. You can um, 
you can make you it's, it, there's features a set of features where you can uh we can add like you can edit your playlist your, your youtube playlist you can have it on autoplay and all that stuff but you know youtube already has all those features though but uh it, it just gives it more features see these this is what it is right here these, it gives it like a ton of features on here and it also gives you video and shows you how it works you know default volume so it has a lot of features on here. It's just like it's just basically you know a, a plus to um your YouTube. You know if you if you like if you want to um this is mainly for if you like a creative artistic person and you like you like a, a good look if you want your YouTube channel to look you know presentable and things like of that sort. This is for you right here. So uh, and I and I actually uh, apply this to my browser. I actually use this um tool. This is probably the only tool I've um apply it to my browser on um, Firefox because I don't really use Firefox like that but I do like Firefox it's pretty interesting so um, I'm more of a Chrome user but I'm I'm starting to use Firefox a little bit more you got their own dictionary but Google yeah it, may, it would usually go to Google like Firefox usually really don't have their own their own search engine they usually use Google of course so um, Google Translator you know especially if you're you know a writer well, you know, you can apply these. These are quick tools, quick tools, so you don't have to go on Google and do all that. You, these are just extensions, and they're that. That's why they're um awesome and good to have on your and to apply to your browser because these are quick accesses. All you gotta do is click it, and then it just drops right here on the top, and you can just and go from there. It's, it's very, it's, just, it's basically like a quick tool, you know, a shortcut tool. Like when you, you got shortcuts on your phone, you just click one thing and it just goes without having to do all these other things. These are shortcut tools. So um, a lot of translators on here you can apply to your um, browser. Um, definitely useful, and you should um, utilize these tools, especially if you're a writer. What else? Um, we're also going to be doing music for the editors out there. So they got video speed control, where you can. Uh, but YouTube already has this option on there. You just click. You just basically click this button right here and it will have that option anyway so most of these are just pretty much you know add-ons they're you know they're, they don't really you don't really need all these they're pretty much just add-on apps they're just extras so um, be mindful that you don't really need all those um, easy YouTube downloader express what's this one uh, it gives you the option to download a video but um, like I said um, YouTube already usually has all that features on here, I guess. I'm pretty sure YouTube already has a download feature where you can download a video, but if it doesn't, this is the app for you if you're a Firefox user. So, uh, what else is on here? Google search, what's this one? I've read about this one, I just haven't. Uh, yeah, so any photo you uh, click on um, Firefox, you can just click it and it goes straight to You can do that. For example, like for example, this right here. You go to a website and uh, you just click a photo, and you can you the uh, the right button on your mouse or your keypad on on the um on your laptop or whatever you have. Just click that, and then um drop down and take you straight to Google, like right here. See, just like that. Click the right button, just it will show right there and take you straight to Google. So um yeah, definitely like a quick tool that's useful to have. But like you know what I'm saying, most people use Google Chrome anyway. So <laughs> um, for security, you know, they got their own um, app blockers, ad blockers, you know, ad blocker for YouTube, YouTube ad blocker. Um let's see if they if this one can stop videos. Yep, so this one I think can stop videos. So if you if you if you're um if there's a lot of ads playing on your video on a uh, Google on um, not Google Chrome stuff on Firefox you can um you don't have to skip it or wait or anything like that it automatically skips so um they have many tools on there it should have a here we go an ad blocker for firefox yeah black ads on any other websites and stuff like that so very useful i recommend this if you're a firefox user and you love firefox you a die hard firefox fan this is awesome this is this is for you so they got their own ad blockers You know some of the other um block site you can block a site if you want to. Yes. 
I mean, it's just another ad blocker, isn't it? Block any site. I guess if you if this is this could be very useful if you have children and you they're using Firefox, this could be very useful. You could protect them and block a lot of things on there to you know protect your uh, kids from uh, certain sites. So I guess this could be useful to you. Hmm. Interesting. Search tools. Yeah, you know more ad blockers. Chrome. What's this one? This add-on is not available. Uh, translate now. So a quick tool. This is probably just another translator tool. It has a lot of languages on here. Quick tool. That's this is the website though. But uh, it's like I said, it's an extension on your browser. You just click and it's a quick tool though. But uh, they have if you don't like that one, they have many um other um tools on there that you can use. Um. Social and communication, Grammarly for Firefox. So if you haven't heard of Grammarly, um, they're an amazing um platform that you know to help you with your um writing. If you're making a presentation, if you're writing a a story, you're making a story, a blog, you know, or or, or um, a book or anything like that. Grammarly is an awesome tool. I use Grammarly on uh, Google Chrome. So Firefox even has their own Grammarly installed or embedded on a setup with them so that's cool so Grammarly on Firefox restore old YouTube this basically is just like I guess I didn't really get it at first this looks like a um, an old version this is this is an old version new version and this isn't like a, this looks like a newer version but clearly it says um restore old YouTube so meaning like if you want to restore your old YouTube if you want the way the old YouTube used to look then you would have this though but it's like new new right here so I don't I don't really get that but uh you can tell the difference if you if your YouTube looks like this and you want it to look a little bit more upgraded this is it for you right here so Firefox uh, tabs, WhatsApp Messenger, pin tab. I got the WhatsApp, Flappy Bird, Quick Tools. What is useful? None of these are really useful. I, don't, I can't really see any of these being useful besides this one. Print and what's this? Let me see. Also, it gives you if you if you connect to a printer, it gives you a quick uh print option. So that's very useful if you're trying to print a paper or something like that. That's very useful to have to have a quick um print option on there. All right, last one we're gonna go to is web development for you web developers out there. You know, uh, font finder. You can find uh, a variety of different fonts, many fonts, even languages, different languages on here. And Embedded code and coders. Yup, coders for you coders. Thought this was like a um a font. Five, yeah, font. Five different fonts. Hmm. That looks like coding right there. So I don't see what that has to do with font finder. I hmm, guess it's some type of coding you can learn. You know, I'm not really big on coding. I tried to do coding at a at a point in time, failed miserably. I mean, I I get the kind. I know I know a few coding. I'm not a um an experienced coder. I'm more like a uh like a, a very very beginner coder. You know, but I do know a couple codes. You know, I'm I'm very good at it, you know coding and writing. You know, in a couple codes and JavaScript and all that stuff. So I'm I'm familiar with coding and you know Python and and all that. And uh, but I'm not much of a coder though. That's not my forte. Cookie editor, awesome, awesome tool. This is an awesome tool. I don't know. Oh my goodness. There you go, right there for all you app, you app developers out there. Brainstorm. Hmm. <laughs> Brainstorm. 
see what you what you like on here so there's a lot of um a lot of uh, extensions on here like I said these are quick tools you know for getting you know shortcuts basically for getting things a little bit easier you can apply to your browser so um Firefox extensions I hope you like the video if you um like the video give this vi um, video a thumbs up uh, subscribe to this channel if you want more content on uh, different um things you know uh websites um uh, browsers on about more about online marketing how ways to make money online um how to become an affiliate marketer how to build a, a brand build a bigger brand awareness you know i have content and uh, valuable content in that sort so it's definitely subscribe to the channel and if you like this video give us a thumbs up and i'll see you guys later in another video see you guys later Peace.